For 10 years, The Source has been helping recovering addicts and alcoholics find a new way of life. Some of the best recovery takes place, one addict helping another over a cup of coffee. In 2004, I was uh, newly in recovery, and it became apparent to me that we needed a place to hold meetings. It was going to be unique in that it was going to be open to the street. And jails or institutions or death would have been exactly the places I would have been, and that's where it left me. So this is going to be a, a new faith in myself and, uh, and hope. You have a place like an oasis in the middle of the desert. Now you have a place where you don't go to a bar anymore, you come here. You don't go and uh, look for drugs, you come here. In 2009, the Dubuque Drug Task Force received a sizable asset forfeiture award based on a multi-state illegal prescription drug investigation that was initiated by the task force and a Dubuque pharmacy. When Community Foundation of Greater Dubuque President and CEO Nancy Van Milligan heard this news, she wondered if the source could be a potential beneficiary of the funds. The source made perfect sense to me as a recipient of some of the dollars. So I contacted the police chief and we worked long and hard to figure out how those dollars could be um, funneled towards the source. When we see a, a program or an operation like the source, um, we know that they are often the final line that keep people from falling off the wagon or getting back into the lifestyle they're trying to get out of. We know that by helping the source keep its doors open, um, we're going to help people stay in recovery. We're going to help ourselves. Uh, because if people are in recovery, they're less apt to get involved in some criminal activity. Although the opportunity to use the original forfeiture funds expired, the Dubuque Drug Task Force successfully identified other forfeiture funds to complete the project. On April 15, 2015, the Dubuque Drug Task Force presented a ceremonial check for $10,000 to the source. These dollars confiscated from a legal drug operation will now support recovery at the source. I believe that it has come full circle. The very thing that uh, was used when we're out there in the world. We could turn this around to uh, something to support us right at the bottom line, right at the very base level of this disease.